Shalom everyone, a huge schut to have Rabbi Shmuel Phillips over here. He's the author of two fantastic books, Judaism Reclaimed and Talmud Reclaimed, to share a word over about Parshat Nitzavim and also Rosh Hashanah. Parshat Nitzavim and Rosh Hashanah. So, Parshat Nitzavim, we have an intriguing prosok right before Shemi, which tells us, Hanisoros Hashem Rekeinu, the hidden matters of Hashem your God, by Niglois and things that are revealed, Lonel Benenu Adolam. So what are the hidden matters and what are the revealed matters? There are many different explanations. But one fascinating one is that when we come, attempt to come close to God, times of Rosh Hashanah, Yom Kippur, Dushu Hashem Hitz, Behemotzor, seek God, to try to come close to Him when He's to be found, it's referring to Rosh Hashanah, Yom Kippur, we have to also realise His greatness. And the more we realise His greatness and how distant He is from us, paradoxically, the more we come close to Him. Which is why in the Kaddish, we say, Le'ela, Le'ela, Mikol V'chasav HaShiyosah. He is far, far beyond any praise or description we have. During the year we say, Le'ela, Mikol V'chasav. He's above any praise we have of Him. Do When we come close to Him, and we, we are doing the Selichot, and we're praying, and we're getting close, we realise, Le'ela, Le'ela. The closer we come to Him, the more we realise that He is really far, far beyond us. And it's an ongoing paradox we come closer to him, we realise how much greater he is. And that is part of the Avodah of Rosh Hashanah Yom Kippur. Amen. Shana Tavah.